Welcome back to Every Other Carl. I'm Carl. It is frozen cold out, and I found some good backcountry roads to test out the off-roading capability of my Honda Ridgeline. This is the terrain I'm talking about. It's kind of a not super steep grade hill. I'm gonna take it, just in case you're wondering. I'm on Cooper HT tires. Pretty much brand new. And they're performing really well. So the Ridgeline, like the Honda Pilot, has VTM, which is variable torque management. So it's not a, a traditional four-wheel drive system where all four wheels have power all the time. The transmission has sensors in it uh, and it works in connection with the tire pressure monitors and some other stuff and checks whenever there's slippage and it decides which wheels need to have more power or more torque dedicated to them. So typically if you're just driving on a flat dry surface, it's just going to be primarily front wheel drive. And that helps with fuel efficiency. Uh, but if the sensors detect slippage, it's going to turn you into an all wheel drive vehicle and send power to the back. I found that it was extremely intelligent. I had very little slippage at all. And I was very impressed. I'm off the mountain, it's a little bit later in the day, and uh, it's heated up a little bit. So I found this great mud patch in a parking lot and see if I can get the truck stuck. Uh, there's also a cool hill climb, see if I can get up and over that. That's it, we're back on pavement. I lost traction maybe twice for a split second each when I was on a complete slab of ice. Otherwise, just incredibly impressed by the all-wheel drive in this Ridgeline. Um, and I'll give props to the Cooper tires as well. Yeah, definitely, it's not, this isn't like an off-road vehicle necessarily, but it is very secure. It has enough clearance to do uh, a pretty medium grade trail. Um, yeah. Until next time, like, comment, subscribe if you would please, and I'll catch you in the next one. Thanks.